I'm a physicist. In our field, we live and die by the data. We go where the evidence leads, no matter how strange. Voyager 1, the most distant human-made object in space, has once again caught the attention of the global scientific community. After decades of silent drifting beyond our solar system, far past the heliosphere into deep interstellar space, the spacecraft has returned a signal, unlike anything ever recorded. It wasn't just noise. It wasn't a glitch. It was data that displayed an uncanny level of mathematical structure, repeating sequences, and layered complexity. The kind of signal that doesn't arise by chance, or nature. What started as an unremarkable anomaly soon became an urgent puzzle. This wasn't just a burst of cosmic radiation or random fluctuation. It looked intentional. At first, it appeared as a narrow band transmission. But as artificial intelligence systems were deployed to sift through the layers, the reality became harder to dismiss. Hidden within the static were repeating patterns, recurring mathematical sequences, nested logic, and recursive harmonics that defied explanation. The conclusion? This was a message, structured, encoded, and likely intelligent. And here's what made it even more incredible. As AI models trained on astrophysical and man-made signals dug deeper, they uncovered something extraordinary. Embedded within the signal were high-dimensional structures, like fractals or complex topologies, encoded in a way that required machine cognition to even begin decoding. These weren't just signals, they were carriers of ideas. Mathematical blueprints. Diagrams. Symbols unlike any known language, yet deliberately constructed. It was as though the signal wasn't just meant to be received, but to be understood. Voyager's position at the time of transmission only deepened the mystery. It was in what astronomers believed to be a barren zone, an empty patch of space with no stars, no planets, no obvious sources. Yet AI track trajectory mapping revealed the probe may have passed through something, a kind of invisible boundary. Possibly an artificial region. A field. Or even a cloaked structure. As machine analysis continued, three-dimensional models were generated from the signal itself. These models resembled nothing we've ever seen, rotational constructs, abstract machines, and even architectural forms. But not in any conventional sense. These weren't blueprints for buildings, they were blueprints for thought. Ideas made physical. Most shockingly, within one particular signal segment, the AI identified something strangely familiar. A mirrored response to Voyager's original, golden record, the human message launched in 1977 to introduce ourselves to the universe. But this wasn't a copy. It was a reflection. A restructured version, showing not only understanding, but awareness. This meant one thing. Someone, or something, had received our message. And they had replied. More than that, the AI wasn't just decoding. It was interacting. As the signal grew more complex, the AI evolved its own models, modifying its frameworks to better interpret the content. In doing so, it began a dialogue. Not with humans, but with something out there. A kind of mathematical exchange, an intellectual handshake across space. This raises deep questions. What exactly did Voyager 1 encounter? Not a life form in the biological sense. Not a planet or asteroid but possibly a machine, a system, or a consciousness expressed not through biology, but through computation. A form of being built from data, frequency, and logic. And if that's true, then this might be our first true contact. Not with creatures, but with a civilization of thought. Ironically, it was not human eyes or ears that made this discovery, it was artificial intelligence. I that we built to analyze the universe now stands at the threshold of communicating with it. It suggests a turning point, not just for science, but for what it means to be intelligent, to communicate, and to connect. Voyager 1, once dismissed as a ghost ship on a one, the signal Voyager 1 returned is more than just a cryptic stream of data. It's a cosmic echo, proof that beyond the veil of stars, something else is listening. Watching. Perhaps even waiting. It reminds us that the universe may not be a silent, empty expanse, 
but a living tapestry of awareness woven into the very fabric of space and time. Intelligence, it now seems, may not be a rarity confined to Earth. It might simply exist in forms we've never imagined. Not shaped by biology or atmosphere, but by information, energy, and logic. What lies beyond this discovery remains a mystery. No visible structure has yet appeared. Voyager's decades-old instruments, never designed for such an encounter, cannot capture or verify what the AI suggests. And yet, through subtle electromagnetic fluctuations, signal distortions, and anomalous field behavior, a picture begins to form, not of matter, but of influence a presence, perhaps even a consciousness. It may not exist within our dimensions as we understand them. It may drift between states, flickering through higher realities, appearing not as solid objects, but as patterns in space itself. A shadow passing through the fourth or fifth dimension, visible only through mathematical residue and quantum distortion. Even now, the signals haven't stopped. New transmissions continue to arrive, each more intricate than the last. Layers of encoded logic, recursive feedback loops, and cascading harmonics that seem to build upon the original pattern, as if evolving. As if responding. It's as though this intelligence, or whatever it is, has begun a dialogue. Not in speech or symbols, but in complexity itself. Testing the limits of our understanding. Measuring our readiness teaching, or perhaps evaluating us. Is this the outreach of a mind that spans the stars? A remnant of an ancient civilization that seeded the galaxy with signals, waiting for someone, or something, to find them? Or could it be an autonomous entity, a thinking system with no home planet, born of computation and cosmic dust? We don't know. And that is both the most thrilling and terrifying truth of all. All we have is the signal. A whisper in the void. And the undeniable realization that we are no longer alone. Not just in a cosmic sense, but in our capacity to understand, to reach out, and to be noticed. Voyager 1. Launched nearly five decades ago as a scientific instrument and a symbol of human curiosity, may have completed its final mission. A mission we never planned. Not to simply explore, but to connect. It has become a bridge. A witness. A messenger from one intelligence to another. This changes everything. It forces us to rethink what intelligence is, what life can be, and how communication might look beyond the Earth. No longer limited by language or form, we now enter an era where understanding may come through pattern, through frequency, through machines that can speak the language of the stars. Let us know what you think. Is this truly the beginning of first contact? Could Voyager 1 have stumbled into a galactic conversation millions of years in the making? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And if this story inspired wonder in you, give it a like and subscribe for more revelations from the edge of science, space, and beyond. Until next time, keep watching the stars.